Welcome to this Excel quickie. Here I'm going to show you how to remove table formatting in Excel and a couple caveats related to that. So here we have a table. It is not just a regular data table. It is insert table. So it's that special little format that you get when you click this and you get all sorts of awesome options like filtering and sorting added in there. And you can use formulas like this where you reference the title for the column or the header. So it makes managing data pretty easy, but sometimes you want to remove it. And it's very simple. You just click within the table, go to table design, and then go to convert to range. In some versions of Excel, it's just the design tab for the table when you click it. So go there, go to convert to a range, and then confirm that you want to convert it to a normal range. And now you've got this, but you still have the formatting. So the little buttons for sorting and filtering are gone. But if you want to get the formatting gone as well, just select the entire table and then go to the Home tab over here to Editing, and you can do Clear Formats. And that's going to remove all the formats. Or you can just quickly change the background color of the cells and the borders and whatever else you need to. But you do have to remove that formatting separately. Now, one thing to pay attention to is now that you have your data here, everything's good. Notice the formulas have now been converted to the normal way that formulas are referenced with cell references like B6, D6, and down here as well. This little total cell is a formula with regular sheet and cell references. So if you decide now that you want to go back to a table, so you click in here and go to Insert, Table, Make sure it selects everything correctly, hit OK. It looks OK, right? But it's not exactly how it was before. So if we look at a formula, it's a regular formula. It's not the table formula. And yes, you can go ahead and rebuild all of your formulas. So you could just go like this and this and then copy it down. But if you have a really big table, that's going to take a long time. So Number one thing, just don't switch between table formatting and regular formatting and going back and forth because it's not just formatting that changes. It's the way the formulas themselves are made. So if you just want a table with all of the features that tables have, such as how you can make formulas and reference them, but you don't like the formatting, just click in here, go to table design, and then go to table styles and choose this very basic one that has no formatting attached to it. So now you have a table with all of the great features. You just don't have that formatting that you didn't like. And that's how you can remove table formatting from tables in Excel.